Salutations! This is Winterwolf88 bringing you another Let's Play, this time of a game that's been in limbo for eternity, otherwise known as The Elder Scrolls for Oblivion! And yes, I'm actually going to continue my playthrough of this game at the request of a few people. Um, actually a little bit surprised that some of you folks still want to watch this. This is like the Minecraft of the RPG world. Everyone has a video on it. But I'll go ahead and upload here and there. So let's go ahead and continue on our adventure. Um, I did actually figure out where I put my save game file, which was kind of nice. Um, I had misplaced them. I'm pretty good at doing stuff like that. So, yay! I recovered it, and I don't have to make another character again, because it gets kind of tiresome after the fourth or fifth time you have to remake a character, and it's like, ah, oh, I don't want to play this game anymore. But, um, yes! Been distracted by all the other games on my computer! And this one just kind of lurks in the background, and it's probably going to take a backseat to, uh, Morrowind when I do the graphics overhaul, so... We'll see how it goes! And I'm going to ramble. Because rambling's fun! Alrighty! Well, anyways, as we left off previously, the Emperor, he got murdered by that dude. Because, or maybe it's a woman. I don't know. They're face down in their own blood. But there's no blood present, so I don't think. Yeah. Well, anyways, um, so that lad over there gave us a key, which we need to go over there to use, and, um, yes, I think he also stripped me of my sword, so I need to re-equip something else. I think I gotta go ahead and use a steel short sword. I have my inventory. Yee, I'm totally a mod at race. You see nothing! And I'm going to equip it here as well, so I actually have a weapon. Oh, there, I did it again. Um, alright, well, there's really nothing more to be had here. So check this side room. Relieve. You died? How could you die? You were supposed to be alive and keep your friend company and not keep hitting the escape button because that doesn't do anyone any good. Goodbye. Sorry, Mr. Emperor Man. Leave I the Emperor in peace. I, I can't loot his body. Sadness. <sighs> Goodbye, Picard. Alright. We open the door. Whee. Oh. And it's a go. A journeyman of blunt can afford a sideways power attack with a chance of disarming the opponent. Yay! That's what I've always needed. I'm gonna equip my bow. And we're going to scroll about the dungeon. Yes, yes. Can I hear water? Doesn't look like there's anything of interest, so we're gonna continue on. On Married and Adventure. See what I'm doing, but yes. Yeah! All right. Well, that was exciting. Hmm. There's probably one more bad guy. Part two. There's a rat. Um, let's go ahead and use the bow on this one. Well, that was. Bloody. Um. Okay then. <coughs> Let's go ahead and. Uh, uh, why is something bleeding that much? It's a little bit chilly. Um. I'm going to sneak. This one is. Isn't there another problem here? Yay! I'm gonna steal your shield. 
I will see what's on your body. I want your nuggets and your lockpick. And maybe the garlic, because garlic is nummity num goodness. Well, not to mention, it keeps Edward Cullen at bay, I think. Ugh, Twilight. Ah, that movie's gonna come out soon. I think it comes out next month. Gee. I just go to watch the rabid fangirls, and maybe the cougars, because ooh, there's a fair away mist. No offense to the Twilight fans, they're just cheese wheels! Oh my goodness! There's actually- Can I take them all? How much do they weigh? They're three pounds a piece. Um, never mind. I, I would totally take the cheese wheels, but they're, um, a bit, uh, heavy. And uh, I, I don't really see the point of carrying it around. Um, or the flower, for that matter. Yeah, we're gonna pretend you didn't hear anything about the cheese wheels. Unfortunately, cheese has to do with a, a running joke that um, will not seem to fade. That's been going on for a couple years. But anyways, um, we're going over this week into the depths of... Oh. Oola. That was interesting. Um, wow, that was glitchy. I don't know what to say to that. Besides, let's go kill some stuff. And, ooh, there's some bones. Yay! Um, why can't you sell bones? They should have a worth. That would be nice, because I'm sure there's some alchemist out there who's like, Ooh, ha ha ha, I need human bones for my potion of evilness, but no, I don't want to fail. Um, okay, I'm going to go ahead and quick save this. Whoosh, I figured out what key that was, and we're going to exit. Yes, I, I, I am what I want to be, so we're good. Finish. Destruction magic has spells that disintegrate to weapons and armor, making them break sooner. Oh, oh, oh because... That's what I've always wanted, disintegrating weapons and armor. It's a thing about high willpower. Pretty. Leaves. Yay! Journal. The red arrow on your compass shows the direction of way on Priory. Nada, you can walk there by following your compass, or use your world map to travel there directly. But that's cheating. Or you could set off in any direction and begin exploring the world on your own. Good luck. I think I'm going with the latter, because that would be more entertaining and more experience. And trees. It's a pretty butterfly. <laughs> okay. Um, hmm. I think the city is up behind us. Yeah, you can see the walls. Um, however, oh, hey. I'm actually going to go over here. That guy's over here. There's an apple. Mm, apple. I still missed! To right there! It was Sneaky Sneaky Ninja! You saw nothing. Sneaky. Sneaky Ninja-ness. Your friend is dead. You saw no idea. Oh, you see me, darn it. Stop the 
speaking. Go forth. Oh. <gasps> the angry chick with the bow and the deafness and the die. Make something. Nope. Nothing at all. Nothing to see here. Just a dead body. Hello. Dead body? How are you? You don't even have a name. You're just a bend to bone. I want your luck pick. And your arrows. Yay! And I didn't hit Prestig Skiki. How so? And there's some, some shoes. Oh yes, that this totally works. Um, what am I wearing anyways? Uh, armor. Um, there are arrows sticking out of my arm and, and my shoulder and my other owl. That doesn't look healthy. She really should get those treated. Um, okay, that looks ridiculous. I, I'm not gonna think about that too much. I'll go over here and pick up the mutton. Mutton. Hello, bandit! Killed you. You didn't even see me coming. Alright, uh. Let's see what I'm doing. Only two bandits? Okay, so. I draw power from a well. In the stormy out. Hey, it looks like outside! Yay! It's a little stormy and crumpy and raw mud crab. 